Hello everyone, Quintic formula. Well, because the Galois theory and Abel Ruffini theorem that it is impossible to solve a Quintic equation like this. Like this, x to the power of 5 minus 3x, or like this, by radicals, it's impossible. Just using hypergeometric functions, you can solve this type this kind of the, the equation but by radicals you can solve using a, a specific equation let's see the, the equation well x to the power 5 plus a x plus b now we need to add something here in the last term to solve our equation but re rela the relation with the, the coefficient need be established well how? If you get the Martinez polynomial, we can just use a octet equation to solve the equation using the the formula, the normal formula, the Bhaskara formula to solve the fourth degree equation but add k that is the the one of the roots of the the Martinez polynomial you can solve this equation easily but you you must thinking the the this the follow the follow the the following um if you put a k here you can solve this equation easily if you put a in b here but you use the a and b and k to solve the quintic equation by radicals now if you use for example 1 to the power 5 plus 2 1 plus minus uh, minus 3 times 1 you can solve this equation easily k is the 1 a is 2 b is minus 3 the root on the one of the roots did the this equate this equation is one, but the case that is also uh, uh, one. But using a and b in k, you can also solve this equation by radicals. Let's see the idea.
x plus a x plus b five square root of a plus two a b plus five b square plus three a plus eleven b divided by two to the power one over four this equation this kind of the equation all all of this uh, all kind all kind of this equation is solvable by radicals okay but the difference this equation of this equation that this we will not define a root in k to to solve the to to, to use this 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 the the, the, the root uh, x the root and the the k to solve the equation by radicals but but here in second equation we will use the a and b coefficient to solve this equation by radicals let's see let's see a, a, a example x to the power 5 plus 5 minus uh, sorry minus x uh, 5 5 55 plus 7 let's start this quickly let's finish this quickly I mean a to the power 2 plus 2 a times b plus 5 to b to the power 2 2 thousand fifty hundred five hundred sorry plus oh sorry minus three times a is a hundred sixty five plus eleven b seven seven divided by two to the power one over four okay this equation solving this equation or better uh, using the the calculator to calculate the 5 times square root of 2500 minus this is this will give us give us 
7 times 3. K. Então, K. So, K is 3 and B is 7. Ok? Ok. Now, to solve this equation, 7 x to the power 5 minus 5, 5 x plus 21 we need to use the the Martinelli's polynomial the Martinelli's relation to split the, the equation into two equations one of the degree 2 and another degree 3 so let's see the two first the two first equation if they are or better I mean the two roots of the, the equation x x to the power 2 minus 3 this is the k plus 2 k to the power 5 minus 5 5 times k minus 21 over 5k to the power 3 this equal 0 this is will give us the two roots of the the 50 degree equation this split that equation Using the quadratic formula, you get x equal 3 minus, my, plus and minus 9 minus 4 times 1. Because this is 1 divided by 2 the two roots real roots of the this equation this equation is 3 my plus 5 over 2 and x 3 minus 5 over 2 if you insert this this is equation this root here you get 0 as an answer The other, the, the the others roots you give us you give us using the cubic formula. K x to the power two plus k. minus 2k plus a k minus b over 5 over k 
x now plus 21 over 2k plus a k plus minus sorry minus b over equal zero using a transformation to using a transformation to eliminate this term to the form x to the power 3 plus p x plus k equals 0 you can use the cubic formula to get the another's the another other uh, roots of the quinta category equation. So that's it. That's it. There is no secret. There is no. Nothing to to think about. Because it's very easy to to solve a quintic equation this way using the a b associated to b coefficient. Okay, this is the quintic formula. This is a, a, a way to solve a quintic formula that solve a quintic equation. Sorry. I mean, the, the quintic form, uh, formula this, uh, is this. K is this. It's very easy. No, there is no secret. There is no issues to solve a uh, quintic equation using this method but you need to to know the martinez polynomial to solve to to understand better this um this this proof the the proof of the the quintic formula okay thank you for watching and bye